Hey guys, it's John, here with a game called Life is Strange. This is a new episodic adventure game. I'm told it's kind of in the vein of the Telltale Games portfolio, so that sounds promising. The only episode that's currently released is episode one, and we're going to be playing it. I actually downloaded this game several weeks ago with the intention of playing it uh, very quickly, but that didn't end up happening, and now apparently everyone on YouTube has played this, so I'm late to the party, but I still came. So let's go. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Duly noted, sir. Or, ma'am. I can help you. I, I can make you do things. Use caution on trail. Dangerous drop-offs. That's nice. Perfect time for a storm. Thank you, I know how to play video games. <laughs> I know that the mouse moves the camera. But I appreciate the tip. That's what she said. What does this say? Blackwell Academy 1910? Hmm. She doesn't look like she's from 1910. Maybe that's when the school was founded. That would probably make sense. Famously called film little pieces of time but he could be talking about photography as he likely was okay i'm in class everything's cool i am okay from light to shadow from color to chiaroscuro now can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black i didn't and white? fall asleep and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream Bueller. weird diane arbus there you go, Victoria. Diane Arbus. Arbus. Look at the because big brain on phone vibrator over here. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? Uh, and frankly, it's bullshit. How do I do this? Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. Wait, why? I can frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of look. desperation. I and would like to look. could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? She had a brilliant eye, so. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Yeah, I can too. Uh. She could have taken another approach. I have to That's admit, case. I'm not a big fan of her work. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. Don't worry but about it. I like it old school. Do what you want to do. America. Don't take a selfie. And it was honesty about the economic conditions of the era. 
But I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Well, let's read it. What you got? Which, explain. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh. Uh... Feels sort of intrusive to read this, but let's do it. October, my favorite month. The best weather of the year. Also, when John's birthday is. I love that guy. He's my favorite YouTuber. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. But it's still too damn hot. Thanks, global warming. And I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies just yet. Soon. Kate let me borrow The October Country by Ray Bradbury. I haven't read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek cred before I held up my copy of Battle Royale. Oh, nice. But he nails the autumn atmosphere of small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. It's that or a Vortex Club Stroke Fest swimming party. What? Or is that backstroke fest? You you so punny, Max. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy. As my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. Oh my. How many pa- That is cra- I, Do I really have to read all this? Well. Wait, what? When was that last entry? October, right? October 1st, 2013? Yeah. Well, we can just skim, I guess. Uh, she was accepted in July, so she'd only been there for a couple months. Why? Okay, so she got in. It's a unique and famous private school for seniors. A senior-only private school? I was not aware of the existence of such academic institutions. She got a scholarship to a, what? To a high school? Okay, well, cool. Wait, extra financial support. Ah, oh, so she got there for free. That's good. Leaving Seattle. Uh huh. Chloe, she loves Chloe. She's like her best friend. Oh dear. <laughs> That's great. Shit is crazy here, with a K. I remember writing shit like that in my journal, too. So, she's having trouble making friends. Mm hmm. Blackwell sucks ass. I told myself not to whine so soon, but damn. Ooh, okay. How could I forget Victoria Chase? Rich, stylish, and titled. I could feel instant judgment when she looked at my raggedy ass clothes. As if I'm at Blackwell to strike fashion poses. Maybe I'm being extra crispy sensitive, but I think Victoria wants life here to be like her own reality show. Alright, so you don't like Victoria. You miss Chloe. You just started here. Mr. Jefferson. So she likes Mr. Jefferson's photography class, even though she's not paying attention right now. Oh, okay, here's everybody. Oh, this is... Vi oh, really? So this is, this is Victoria, the elite of Blackwell Academy and a total bitch. Awesome. Kate Marsh, she's an uh, uh, emotionally vacant individual from the looks of it. Looks like you got a crush on your teacher. Maybe not, but you just really admire him. Your name is Max. Talking about the scholarship. All right. I think we got it. Oh. These are the stuff. So we can come back to this journal at any time. We can also... Yeah, let's call our mom in the middle of class. I don't know who Warren is, but... His wife Frank was Kerouac's We'll find out leaders. later. And both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Do I really like to take a selfie? We've all seen that iconic I do shot love my analog camera. camera. And if you I should take a quick shape. picture now. Why? Really? In the middle of class? Alright, fine. You dig? Now, contrast Frank's stark Americana with Salvador Dali's... Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. 
Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, you're asking me? I, I did know. I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Seguer was a French painter who oh, created give me a break. types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella Don't and ask Lisa, to see me after class. Taylor, Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. What a dick. I hate teachers like this. Pretend to be all cool. Oh, brother. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Oh my god, do I have to deal with high school persecution all over again? Give me a break. Hey. Hi, Kate. Hi, Kate. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Thing. Hi, Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh. I'm Max. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Fine. Uh, what what what's going on here? Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Why why is this like cleavage central? Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Yes. Sorry, all I see is cleavage. Let's leave. What is going on here? This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. I don't know why. He's a dick bag. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Yeah. Well, don't interrupt their conversation. Let's GTFO. What? Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. <laughs> What's, what's this thing? Oh, this is the photo contest? Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Let's read it. Okay. The winner will fly in San Francisco. Uh-huh. Deadline is October 15th, so coming up pretty soon. Best represents yourself or others in heroic action. So why did you take a selfie? I'm sorry, I made you, you do Caulfield. it. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Well, I didn't realize that's what we were doing. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, 
All you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Okay, so when are we gonna talk about my entry? Can I leave now? I get that you're trying to be the cool teacher, but I'm kinda over it. I'm gonna open the door now. Bye. I was about to. I'm not paying you always Welcome to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. What 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 was that about sending a special picture? They're talking about nudes! I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Wait, what? This is Square Enix? I had no idea. She's so fucking shy. Wow, that's weird. I had no idea that they were behind this. Now I have very mixed feelings. <laughs> That's what Square Enix will do to you. Oh man, content ID central right here. Evan. Let's look at Evan. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Uh, d uh, is this like a photography school? What's the deal? Alyssa is always texting. She doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Yeah, I know a lot of people like that. Who's this dude? Thinks he runs the hallway. Bully free, it starts with me. Yes, this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. Mm. Don't smoke. If you care, don't pollute the air. We all deserve clean lungs. Okay. Anyway. That's Dana talking to... I think his name is Justin. Dana needs to get some new jeans. These are all worn out. Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. With her bra she showing. In a factory. I shouldn't be so catty. Dana is nice to me. Okay, well, if she's nice, then cool. I don't have a problem with her. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I wish I Man, can I change it to metal or something? <laughs> I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Warren? You have that dude's number in your phone. What's happening here? Looks like some bullying happening. I'm not cool with that. Poor Daniel. He's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. This guy? I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. What's the Vortex Club? I forget. Poor Daniel. He's oh. so nice. I thought... I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. Who's this, like... <laughs> Coattail rider over here. Give me a break. Bully by association. I wish October would last forever. I don't. That would be weird. Hi. Okay, someone's on a mission. Don't need a PC. Missed the poetry GM tryout, and I did not steal that backpack. Uh, you definitely do need a PC, otherwise how are you going to play video games? I was going to say... That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Mm-hmm. Missing person? I wonder what actually happened. Tattoo on calf of a dragon and a star on the inside of the left wrist. Watch out for those. Good thing I left my AK at home. Yeah, seriously. Use of tobacco products prohibited. Evil tobacco. We've already gotten hammered in the face with it twice. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. I'll trust you. Trust your judgment there. What is going on over here? There's Juliet from my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. What? What is the Vortex Club? I think I skimmed by it. 
She's cute. I like Skater Boy. Too bad they don't like me. Oh, God. What a dumb shirt. I'd probably wear something like that, sadly. Yay, Halloween. My favorite time of year. Mm -hmm. Let's talk to Miss Grant. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. Okay, that's all we need to know. Hey, I think girl on a mission just made a lap around the entire school. Might be wrong. Samuel. God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of like that about him. To all of you, you can really learn a lot about the school by the weird shit posted on the board. Best singer ever in Oregon looking for best guitarist ever to form kick-ass band to take over the world. Something about a Bible study, swim like an otter, retired PE teacher and former otter champion will personally train you to glide through the water and embrace your inner otter. Okay. Tablet for sale. Contains five gigs of cat pics. Uh, it's better than cat piss, right? I don't know where that came from. Let's look at the trophy. Look at these trophies. Gotta give it up for those Bigfoots. They do stomp. They do? Well, good. Alright, uh, I guess we're pretty much done here. Blackwell sure takes its swimming seriously. But otters are cute. Go otters. So the two things that happen at this school are photography and swimming, apparently. And drama. So this is like, a uh, arts. Oh, wait. Here, this is where we go. It's like a liberal arts school. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. Ah, <sighs> oh, man. Good thing we got that music out of the way. Thought I was watching Garden State all over again. Now who would bother to write that crap? Rachel Amber is a bitch. Hmm. Wait, what? What did I just see? What did I just see on the wall? Did I see what I think I saw? Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. I could have sworn I saw glasses and a mustache. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Where did I see that? Okay, there's a crown. What the hell? I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Okay, it's not what I thought it was. Good. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Oh, getting a little political. Whoa. <sighs> Cat twerks for God? This poster must drive people to have sex. Absence makes the heart grow fonder. You can still love and learn without sex. Time is on your side. So is condom, I mean common sense. Use it. Okay, got an Illuminati symbol. I hate Victoria Chase. Right there with ya. <gasps> Let's take a photo! Um, hey, uh, you're not supposed to be in here. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now. Let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. 
You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? Are you fucking serious? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! <gasps> no! What? What? Wait, what? Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. She likely was. These pieces of time can frame us in I already heard this lecture. So now you can answer the question. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. I broke okay. my camera. If I'm crazy. I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? What? Come back, camera. Come back. I did now, it. Can you I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human, human time machine. Black and white. Anybody? Max, Bueller? don't Diane. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, Max. Faces. You feel like totally haunted uh, by those like sad mothers When I took my selfie, Jefferson she asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does again, I'll know this is for real. All right. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max is. That's a weird thing for him to say. Selfie. A dumb word for a Talking about dark corners. Tradition. And Max. As a gift. I know I'm not of dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl selfie. isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. What? No, I know the answer! Hey! Fine! I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after Alice class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. She's horrible. Mind again the process, and give him the right answer. Find detail in people's faces, making them extremely pop. What? So I can rewind? Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self yeah louis daguerre or whatever the daguerrean process the daguerrean process invented by a french painter named louis daguerre around 1830 somebody has been reading as well as posing nice work max <sighs> the <Daguerrean> process <laughs> Eat made it. literature hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. Just because I answered that one question? The deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. 
What? Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Uh, okay. Well, let's talk to Kate first and have the exact same conversation. Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um, <laughs> did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just tripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. Uh, I wish we didn't. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. I hope you feel better. Etched marks. Huh, this might make a cool shot. What does it say? I only want to share whatever gifts I have with the world. Rachel Amber forever? Who the hell is Rachel Amber? Should I know who that is? Hey, I got an achievement for that for I some see reason. You, Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Uh, why do we have to talk about this again? I'd never let one of photography's future. All right. Uh, wait. What was the question? Shit. Uh. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. I'm sorry, but freaking these... Wait, press control to quickly undo your previous action? Why would I do that? So I I talked to him first. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. <laughs> I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, oh god. What? <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> Why would I say this? Okay, let's go for it. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Yeah, you're kind of cheating. Ugh. Victoria. All right. Uh, open. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Well, I I lollygagged around a lot earlier, so don't worry about it. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. I hate that science class with those okay, nerds. Okay, retrace every step. I washed my face, I shredded my photo, then the butterfly flew in, Uh huh. and I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that man down! You're going to get hurt. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! No, he what? has a gun. What? I should do something else. Oh, okay. Fire, fire bell. Your punk ass, would they? Get that gun I need away. a hammer to break it open. Fuck! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Yeah, I get it. Thanks. Ow. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble there it is. for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! What? Oh, shit! What the fuck? I like had no, no time. No, no, no. My God. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hell Wait, what? more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would oh. ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Would you really say that? He still has a gun. I'm 
Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? I don't know, man. Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. Oh my I god. Use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Holy shit! Thank you, Mr. Madsen. It's been like 30 the seconds. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. I don't think I've ever seen a fire alarm in the restroom like that before. But, alright. Thank you, sir. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? What? Well, Max, talk to me. Jeez. Report Nathan. Oh, we're gonna fucking report Nathan. Are you fucking kidding me? Of course. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? I pulled the fire alarm. Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. <laughs> the of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? No, fuck it. I'm sticking with that. That's fine. I'm good with that. Ready to get your ass kicked? <laughs> oh, God. Right, let's do it. The, 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 the animations are a little weird. They're a little off. But, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm digging this so far, it's fun. It's got a way different feel to it than, you know, the Telltale games. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, I feel like this should be like, like, she, she seems kind of like a, I don't know. Oh, what's that girl's name? Uh, who, who's the actress I'm thinking of Rachel from Juno? Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened. Oh, to her. that's Rachel Amber. Oh, gotcha. Wow. Um. Oh God. And Anna. Ah, uh, oh, gosh, I can't remember. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Uh, oh my god. I have no idea. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. 
I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. Ellen Page, that's her name. Rachel is found safe and sound. <laughs> Sorry. Soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace. Not fear and violence. Mm, I don't like any of these answers. Blackwell, is that old? Oh my god. You know a lot, Miss Grant. And then, well, what, what about the Native Americans? I don't want to answer any of these. You know a lot. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Freaking, I don't know. Don't sign. Miss Grant, I totally respect your passion and knowledge, but some security cameras make me feel a little safer. I'm not against security, Max. We should all be concerned when private space becomes public. Your generation has been tricked to think everything should be recorded. Well, this actually will have consequences. All right. I'm cool with my decisions. Did I just get a text? Wait, what? Wait, what? What? I, I can't keep up with this. Wait, I, what, what, what just transpired? Whoa, lots of <laughs> text without a response. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study. Please. No response. Make sure you check out Necromantic on my flash drive. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if we bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. I would respond to these texts. What's wrong with her? Don't ignore this message. Hey, Max, can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello? Those were sent in the same minute. Calm, calm your shit, dude. Sorry, running late, insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool, you'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. But where's your where's your flash drive? Where is it? All right. Let's take a let's take a look at my text with Kate. Hey Max, you around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely, I'll be free after four. T T Y L. Okay. So they're friends. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. Okay. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still our little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Aw. How come she doesn't text anybody back? What's wrong with her? Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Give me a second. Alright? I got people to talk to. Who's this asshole? Okay, we can't talk to him. Can we talk to <laughs> Miss Tanning Bed over here? This advertising space is not being used. Mark Jefferson Retrospective. What a crazy awesome picture. Photograph. Dormitories, main building, parking. Daniel, stop being bullied. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Uh... I don't know if I'd be honored. Maybe not right now. I'd rather not, Daniel. Not that I don't want you to. Never mind. I guess you would be too ashamed. Now, I have to get back to my drawing. This action will have consequences. Well, sorry. I didn't... I mean, it hurt your feelings. I just have to do stuff right now. Who's Stella? Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. 
Isn't he incredible? Uh, he's he's not aloof. Uh. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher, and I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. Uh, if Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. What? Make a move? What do you mean? What do you mean make a move? You want him to go to jail? Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. What? Now, what? How what do you is know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. What? Well, I heard that from a good source. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Like what? Maybe Miss Doily Shorts over here can tell me something. <laughs> Is that what those are? Those like weird doily sh shorts. You guys know what I'm talking about? I see, I see women wearing those all the time. I think they're just silly. Sit. Why would I sit here? Can my dad be okay? You guys are. Mm. Please find me a BF for prom. Please go ahead and kill me. These are very, very dramatic. Oh my God, these are so dramatic. I'm so glad I'm not in high school anymore. Holy crap. Everything's like... an extreme freaking superlative situation. Brooke actually has a drone? What? Where is it? Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? No. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? What? Uh, you what? read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Wow. Wow. Man, this is what I mean. Like, this search? You want me to search her bag? I'm not doing that. Uh, it's just, mm, it's like you, you pick the dialogue option, right? And then the character decides to say shit that you wouldn't, that you would rather that they not. That's what makes these games so frustrating. It's like you only get to choose so much. Here's Justin. There's Justin and his skater posse. They're so cute doing their tricks. Oh my god, give me a break. Yes. Yes, the skaters are so cool. That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. I love aloof teenage boys who are rebellious against authority. Who's Evan? He looks pretentious. I don't want to talk to him. Let's go uh, to the dormitories. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. 